Alright, well in order to be able to draw a good cartoon hand, it's a good idea for us to take some time and draw a realistic hand. So to do that, I'm just going to block this out using basic shapes. I've got a rectangle for the palm, about halfway down. I'm going to put a oval for the base of the thumb and another oval for the top of the thumb. And I'm just going to use some curved lines to connect those. So about two-thirds of the palm is what we'll do for our fingers. Now you'll notice that the fingers kind of come up and then down. So I'm just going to indicate that by putting some lines in just so I have an idea of what I'm doing. I also want to fix this palm. It's not a perfect block. It starts off here and then it kind of curves down like so. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to round out this side as well. And that's going to sit on top of our wrist. It's actually not our wrist, it's my wrist. But you can draw my wrist if you want to. I'm going to put middle finger here. I'm just drawing rectangles. The pointer finger and the ring finger are about the same length, but because it goes down like this, it's going to be a little bit lower. And then we're going to divide these fingers up into thirds. And I'm going to put the pinky finger just below that first, that top part. All right, so we've got the proportions now, and then it's just a matter of putting in some curved lines so it's not perfectly, uh, we don't want boxy fingers. I drew a circle at the top of the finger. If you're ever drawing an object that you don't know how to draw, then draw what you do know. If you know how to draw circles, draw the top part of that circle and then it rounds out to the rest of the finger. Alright, I'm going to draw some wrinkle lines here for the thumb. I'm going to round, I don't want a perfect angle here, I'm going to round that out to the wrist. And just a few extra lines there. Just for fun, let's just see how we did. Not too shabby. Those are the basic proportions of the hand. And one last note, uh, it's a good idea just to draw quick sharp lines. If you take too long, your drawings can turn out to be very staticky, very dead, but by keeping them quick and brief, it keeps the drawing a little more alive. That's your basic hand. Next we'll do a cartoon hand.